Welcome to Watch Card's Daily Security Byte. I'm your host, Corey Nockreiner. Today's story has to do with a vulnerability disclosure spat between Google and Microsoft. Early in the week, Google released a zero-day Windows flaw two days before Microsoft patched it. And they did this because of Project Zero. This is their project to find flaws in other people's software and to give those vendors a hard 90 days before they disclose those flaws publicly. Google says they're doing this to improve security. However, as a result, they released details about this vulnerability before Microsoft patched. More importantly, over the past two days, Google has disclosed two new zero-day Windows flaws, one being a pretty serious local privilege escalation flaw that could allow maybe a guest user to gain admin uh, credentials on your Windows computer. Now, Google's doing this because they think 90 days is enough time for vendors to patch. However, I don't really think this is good as far as responsible disclosure. On one hand, software vendors need to take care of critical vulnerabilities quickly. However, there can be certain circumstances that make this type of update take time. So I think it's that kind of disingenuous of Google to stick to a 90-day hard deadline if a vendor is actually working to fix the vulnerability. In the end, this only hurts customers. It doesn't hurt Microsoft. Uh, they plan on fixing the vulnerability in February, but in the meantime, Windows customers out there are at risk of this flaw. So I don't really like this spat between Google and Microsoft. I think it's cool that Google's trying to improve software security, but I think they they need to put some flexibility to their 90-day limit if the vendor is working to fix the flaw. That's it for today's news. Thanks for watching.